administration is committed to community development and this is the reason why we are focused on strengthening our communities by initiating a bottom-to-top approach to governance. We have made the communities an integral part of our decision-making process. It is our communities that must decide what they want from the government and bring it forward. I thank you for the various self-help projects that have been initiated and implemented to complement government efforts in your local communities. You have, by these actions, demonstrated your belief in the fact that development is a collective effort and cannot be left alone for government. Since his assumption of office, the Lagos State Governor, Mr. Akiume Ambadi, has continually engaged community development associations and community development committees in the state, constantly urging them to take ownership of some of its community-based projects, as well as ensure adequate monitoring, management and supervision of the exercise. Within the two years of his administration, Governor Akiomi Ambade has, through the CDAs, constructed roads, drainages, electrification, amongst others. The focus of the recent local government tour was centered on the CDA, making the task more than what it used to be. To be able to carry out this task, the Lagos State Government, through the Ministry of Local Government and Community Affairs, organized a two-day training section for the community leaders. The governor represented at the training program by the state deputy governor, Mrs. Oluranti Adebule, emphasized his determination to make life more meaningful for the electorate through partnership with community associations. Ambody made this statement at the training program organized for the CDCs recently by the Ministry of Local Government and Community Affairs. The two-day leadership training program which had as its theme inclusive governance, a catalyst for sustainable development, is meant to brace up community leaders on the responsibilities placed on their shoulders by the government and residents of the various locations. The special advisor to the Governor on Community Affairs and Communications, Mr. Kane de Bamibeto, identified community ownership and integration as one germane tool necessary to paddling the affairs of good community system to a successful destination. It is the responsibility of all of us who are here to manage the bad, the good, the bad, and the ugly, and make sure that our community can breathe, can be abundant, can be happy. We are the ones who integrate our communities. Speaking on home and neighborhood safety, Assistant Commissioner of Police Olatunji Diso 
shared some security measures to be adopted by the community leaders to keep crime and criminal activities at bay in the various area of jurisdiction. This is said the thieves are not only going to help in keeping families and properties safe, but also for fostering a safe and livable community. This community, do you have a group like what's happening? Lagos State is a very fortunate place in the sense that we have two magic numbers. Two magic numbers. Who wants to give you one? Then you know it already. You want one, two, seven, six, seven. Those numbers work. ACP Diesel provided answer to some questions asked by the community leaders at the two-day training program. Other speakers spoke on leadership finance management in community development.
spoke on leadership finance management and community development system amongst others the interactive and all-inclusive training came to a close and a communique was drafted to be presented to the state government for consideration by the community leaders present at the event As we wrap up today's episode on Lagos Community Updates, we urge you to go back to your various community and make an impactful change. Till I come your way next time, I am Adejo Kenshoda in the Adenyoju. Remember, never ever walk against your community because your community is yours.